A 4.3 magnitude earthquake struck about six miles southeast of Chelan this morning. The quake was felt widely across northern San Luis Obispo County. KSBY News reporter Michael Torres has more. A quick but strong jolt is what most people I spoke with said they experienced at 10.30 this morning. Now some say it happened so quickly they didn't even have time to react. But for others, it was a scary experience. I could hear the precursor and felt a little jolt. And then a few seconds later, it just started going. Lori Alpert is the owner of the Blender store in Paso Robles. She was one of the many Slow County residents who felt the shaking. Alpert says whether it is a big or small earthquake, the shaking is a scary experience. I have been in a few, so it kind of triggers a, a real sensitive spot for me. Others in North County felt a shake but weren't sure if it was the real thing. I heard kind of like a little bang, and then like the shelf over there just kind of like shook. And I, did, I looked at her and I was like, did you feel that? She was like, was that an earthquake? And she's like, yeah, I think so. And while Tuesday's earthquake might have been more of a scare than damaging. It was, it, was, it was just happening real quick. It wasn't like the other ones we've had in the past. Officials say it's important to stay ready for when the big one does come. There's always uh, small little quakes that, uh, that are censored uh, all the time, uh, maybe not to the magnitude that we felt today, uh, but it's definitely something that uh, we got to keep in mind that we are in, in earthquake country and uh, San Luis Obispo is not immune to it. The County of Emergency Services says even when you are unsure, the best thing to do is drop cover and hold on. And if you do feel a quake close to the coast, make your way towards higher ground when the shaking stops in case of a tsunami. Rodriguez says there aren't any reports of damages or injuries in San Luis Obispo County from the earthquake, but says this serves as a reminder to always be prepared. In Paso Robles, Michael Torres, KSBY News.